Good morning, afternoon, friends. Tastic. My name is Kai. This week's topic is trans representation in the media. Um, we kind of did a topic a few weeks ago about trans representation, so we're doing the, like what we would like to see and what is good representation. Last week I was really sick, and to be honest, I'm still kind of sick. Also, my room is in full out art warp mode because I have um, two projects to do for my school. Pretty much at the end of the year my school has us do something they call portfolio projects which is where we pick a topic that we're really interested that we learned and we have to create some kind of like crazy art piece for it and it becomes a huge part of our grade and it's like our final grade. So for my um, history humanities class, I'm doing women and gender in Islam. And so I'm painting a piece that's behind me. And then for my sciences piece, I'm focusing on the HIV AIDS virus. And I'm performing a play and designing a set model for it. So I'm going to start like uploading pictures and stuff of that or um, videos on my personal channel. Um, there's something really cool coming for y'all on my personal channel. I'm waiting till the summer to get back into YouTube because I, like, I'm so close. I have two weeks left to school and then it's just, just freedom. And I wonder, when are y'all, um, ending school? Because I know everyone ends school at different times or maybe you don't go to school. Maybe you're an adult. I don't know. But, uh, yeah. So this summer it's like... I'm getting back into YouTube and probably even going to do like daily vlogs so you're going to see a lot of my face on the internet. Um, yeah, this is like my last busy week which is nice. Anyway, I'm rambling. The topic today is positive representation. What I would like to see for a positive representation, and I say this all the time, I preach it to the skies, is I want there to be less normative trans people in the media. I could say that I want that in general but that's not fair because you be who you want to be. I just wish that the whole concept of trans people media wise wasn't I would like trans people to look like everybody else and then I'll start accepting them. I want to see Gender queer people. I want to see people who, who don't care about stereotypical cis passing, and I just like don't want to see every representation be someone who could pass for cis. I want to, I want the media, and I want people to know that most trans people can't afford, or don't care, or don't want to like look a certain cis way. I think that's really important. I also saw, um, I reblogged this on Tumblr and it was this gif of this trans woman being interviewed and instead of saying post-op or pre-op she said uh, no op and I thought that was interesting because instead of like considering people who don't get operations as pre-op as in one day they would get those operations if they don't want to they are no operations. And I just kind of like that little thing that she said that was really important to clearing up how not all trans people want surgeries. Um, I don't think we really have anyone really like big in the media, but when you think about it, what even is the media? Because like, like I guess like the media is such a confusing term because I feel like there's so many levels of of media and like my celebrity might not be your celebrity kind of thing but as far as we know now Caitlyn Jenner is unfortunately our main leading person um people who are a little bit more informed know about like Laverne Cox and I think she's amazing and just very ideal for representation especially and it doesn't have to do with the fact that she, like it didn't have to do with anything specifically about her except for the fact that like she cares so much about trans issues and I feel like like 
feel like if you're in the public eye as a trans person, you should really do your best to help the community. And I get annoyed when public trans, like people who are in the media who are trans, never try and help out the community. Because I feel like when you have like, uh, like the ableness to to use your voice to do something good with it, why would you not use your voice? Um, yeah, I just want to see more people that I can relate to in the media and more, I would just say like more teenagers and just not the same narrative over and over again. I'm really getting tired of the narrative that all trans people like knew from when they were five and then came out and they're all straight and now they're taking hormones and they've always been the complete gender stereotype. I just think we need to break that down altogether. So my question of the day for you all in the comments below is if you go to school, tell me when your school's getting out and who would you like to see, like, like describe your ideal trans media being. Um, so yeah, that's it for my video today. Subscribe to FGM Transtastic because they're awesome and we've got a lot of good tran on there and on here um thank you guys i am your saturday person and i will see you next week bye